Hello and welcome to this English conversations section in which I portray five conversations this time about describing the complexities of sentence structure so let's dive right in. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe to this channel and also don't forget to buy the best merch from my store from which I put a link in the description of every section and don't forget that the main objective of this channel is to provide the best information about all things related to English grammar to you. Describing the complexities of sentence structure. Conversation 1. Here is a conversation between two characters, Alex and Taylor, discussing the complexities of sentence structure. Alex, have you ever noticed how intricate sentence structures can be? Taylor, absolutely, the way clauses and phrases work together can get really convoluted. Alex, I struggle especially with coordinating conjunctions and how they affect the overall flow. Taylor, I know what you mean, coordinating conjunctions can either add clarity or make things more confusing. Alex, and don't even get me started on dependent and independent clauses. Sometimes it's hard to distinguish between the two. Taylor, right, figuring out which parts of a sentence rely on each other can be quite a puzzle. Alex, exactly, and the placement of modifiers can completely change the meaning of a sentence. Taylor, I've had instances where a misplaced modifier altered the entire context of my writing. Alex, it's fascinating yet challenging how sentence structure can manipulate the tone and message of our communication. Taylor, couldn't agree more. It's a testament to the intricacies of language and its power to convey nuanced ideas. Conversation 2. Here's a conversation between two characters, Sarah and Michael, discussing the complexities of sentence structure. Sarah. Have you ever thought about how much goes into crafting a well-structured sentence? Michael. Oh, absolutely. It's not just about putting words together, it's about creating a meaningful flow. Sarah. I find it challenging to strike a balance between using different types of phrases and maintaining coherence. Michael. Yes, the mix of gerunds, infinitives, and participial phrases can add depth, but it's easy to overcomplicate things. Sarah. I struggle with maintaining parallelism, ensuring that similar ideas have the same grammatical structure. Michael. I hear you. Parallelism is crucial for creating a smooth and harmonious rhythm within a sentence. Sarah. In coordinating different tenses within a sentence without creating confusion can be quite a juggling act. Michael. Definitely, especially when dealing with complex ideas that require multiple layers of explanation. Sarah. I've realized that mastering sentence structure is an art that demands both precision and creativity. Michael. Absolutely, understanding the intricacies allows us to convey our thoughts in the most impactful way possible. Conversation 3. Here's a dialogue between Emma and James, discussing the complexities of sentence structure. Emma. Have you ever stopped to think about just how intricate sentence structure can be? James. Oh, definitely. The way different elements come together to convey meaning is truly fascinating. Emma. I often find myself grappling with the proper placement of commas and how they affect the rhythm of a sentence. James. Commas can be quite tricky, especially when dealing with lists, clauses, and parenthetical elements. Emma. Absolutely. And then there's the challenge of using semicolons and colons effectively to link related ideas. James. Yes, they can help create a sense of connection and hierarchy within a sentence, but misuse can disrupt the flow. Emma. I've also had my fair share of struggles with maintaining a consistent tone while incorporating diverse sentence structures. James. It's a delicate balance, ensuring that the structure doesn't overshadow the intended message or tone of the writing. Emma. Agreed. It's both an art and a science, crafting sentences that are not only grammatically sound but also expressive and engaging. James. Indeed, understanding the intricacies of sentence structure is crucial for effective communication and conveying ideas with clarity and precision. Conversation 4. Here's a conversation between two characters, Lily and Ethan, discussing the complexities of sentence structure. Lily. Have you ever noticed how much thought goes into constructing a well-crafted sentence? Ethan. Oh, absolutely. It's not just about stringing words together, it's about creating a coherent and impactful message. Lily. I often find myself struggling with maintaining a balance between using simple and complex sentences. Ethan. I know what you mean. It's crucial to ensure that the complexity doesn't overshadow the clarity of the message. Lily. 
And then there's the challenge of using different sentence types to create a dynamic and engaging flow. Ethan, definitely. Mixing declarative, interrogative, and imperative sentences can add depth to the narrative. Lily, I've also found it challenging to maintain consistency in tense and point of view throughout a piece. Ethan, yes, consistent tense and perspective are essential for providing a smooth and coherent reading experience. Lily, it's fascinating how sentence structure can shape the overall rhythm and impact of our writing. Ethan, absolutely. Understanding these intricacies allows us to effectively communicate our ideas and connect with our readers on a deeper level. Conversation 5. Here's a conversation between two characters, Ava and Ryan, discussing the complexities of sentence structure. Ava, have you ever thought about how intricate sentence structure can be? Ryan, oh, definitely. Crafting a sentence isn't just about words, it's about conveying meaning in the most effective way. Ava, I often struggle with properly using subordinate clauses without making the sentence overly complicated. Ryan, I understand. Subordinate clauses can add depth, but their placement and integration can be quite tricky. Ava, and then there's the challenge of balancing short, punchy sentences with longer, more descriptive ones. Ryan, finding that balance is key to maintaining a steady pace and keeping the reader engaged. Ava, I've also found it challenging to manage the placement of transitional words and phrases for smooth flow. Ryan, absolutely, using transitions effectively helps create coherence and logical progression within a text. Ava, it's amazing how sentence structure can influence the overall tone and impact of our writing. Ryan, indeed, understanding these complexities is essential for communicating ideas clearly and evocatively. And that is all for this English conversation section until we meet again. Don't forget to support this channel by like, share and subscribe and also to buy the best merch on my store in which I give a link in the description below. This is English Grammar Audio Tutorials signing off.